this is Dr. Larry Lett. I wanted to introduce to you the EMG and nerve conduction velocity portion of evaluating a patient with carpal tunnel syndrome. My goal as a neurologist is to ensure that the patient who has arm and hand symptoms indeed does have carpal tunnel and needs to be treated for that problem rather than some other problem such as tendonitis, arthritis, uh, pinched nerve in another location. And commonly, we'll do an EMG and nerve conduction velocity te uh, testing. It takes about 15 minutes. And you, this involves doing some small shocks. Small electrodes are placed in various areas of this carpal tunnel nerve. And we record from point A to point B and see the time delay as versus the median nerve as compared to the ulnar nerve, which is not in the carpal tunnel area. I'm an expert uh, in doing this evaluation and have been performing it for well over 30 years. Please come and see us, Center for EMG and Neurology. Thanks for watching.